people ask me about how can I take a pick guard off of my guitar. Well, this guitar is actually going to be converted to a 1937. The top's been refinished, it's too thin, and you can see an oversized bridge. So for a conversion, it's perfect. So we're going to show you some things on this guitar before I convert it. Now, how do I take a pick guard off? Well, a pick guard usually comes off relatively easy. We have two type of pick guards with Martin, basically. One is called the under finish where they actually applied the pick guard on the raw wood, finished over it. They were an acetate plastic and really are not used too much anymore. And that method, or the method I'm going to show you, will also work on doing that. We're going to heat this up and we're going to use a very simple tool. We're going to use a hair dryer. So, those of you that are bald, That'll give you an excuse to buy one and people will look at you funny as you go through the Walmart checkout line. Now, the other tools that you're going to need are simple, something that you can get underneath there to work it. Now, I have found over the years I've had pallet knives, I've had a lot of different little, you know, the flexible putty knife. These things are just absolutely wonderful. Now, this happens to be an artist painter's an artist paints palette knife. These are my favorite. Pampered Chef icing knives. Don't let my wife know I stole them from her. Now I'm going to apply a little bit of heat here and you're going to see that this actually is going to work pretty quick. To be honest with you the tip is already starting to come up. High heat setting. And I'm just going to put it right on here. So that you don't damage the finish. Put you know make sure that you feel the temperature of the finish around the car. Now what I'm doing, you can see I'm lifting up on this a little bit and I'm watching the reflection here as the glue, the glue releases, you can see the reflection change. And you can see how my knife is working and sliding in there. And you can see how the glue is softening up as the heat goes through. There's enough heat there and I can feel the glue letting loose and I'm just giving it nice, slow, steady tension. See how it's coming up? That's all you got to do. One nice pick guard. I'm going to keep that one for myself. Anyway, hope you can use that tip. Thanks again, Blues Creek Guitars, my shop to yours. Thanks again, Glenn. Bye-bye.